Hey, you guys, welcome to how to market your local business. I am Connie and this is your five minute marketing tip. Okay, so we're going to talk about Facebook cover photos and profile photos today. Okay, it's the first thing that people see when they are seeing you on Facebook as your business. So we're going to head over and talk a little bit about two businesses that I recently chatted with, and I'm going to show you what I would do for their cover photo in their profile picture. Okay, so let's head on over. Okay, so let's so let's talk about this one first. This is um, Manonic Niagara Brewing Company. Okay. So if you saw this, okay, your cover photo, first of all, should not be two things, okay? It should not be your business name and it should not be your logo, okay? Your business name is already down here and people don't care about logos, <laughs> okay? So if I was gonna take this, I would um, take a couple of photos here Okay, so if I go to his photos, I would add three photos of drinks that he serves. Okay, so it could be this one right here. Okay, it could be a picture of this one. Okay, it just needs to be one can. Okay, and it, you wanna do photos of three. So he's also known for his sangria. And so I would do one of these, a sangria and another drink, okay? And I would put that on, a, on the cover photo, okay? This is the one he's currently using. And yes, it has his logo, but it doesn't tell you about him, okay? So not one that I would use. Let's talk about Hooked on Junk, okay? I love her. She's got the cutest stuff and does amazing events. But when you look at this cover photo, like, it doesn't really tell you what her business is about, right? And so taking a few pictures of items that she sells, okay? So again, taking some pet photos. So think about your own business. Like, what do you sell? Like, it would be cute to do this or this. Okay, and again, do three. Okay, I would make sure it's like really super clear. You could use this one or this one. Um, I would probably use one of these, except I would do more like outside like one of these and put like an event, maybe like this photo here. Okay, but it needs to be a in threes okay and then you can use simple three words um that kind of draw people in a little bit okay so if i was going to do hooked on junk then i would do um vintage finds for your home Okay, more than three words, but like vintage finds for your home. Okay, I would totally do that. For his, I would do craft beer. Okay, maybe a little bit of space, sangria, space, um, you know, fun. Fun, craft beer, fun friends, craft beer. Okay, you want them to just get a sense of who your business is. Okay, and then let's talk about the profile picture right quick. Unless you're Nike, it should not be your logo. And one of the reasons they say it shouldn't be your logo was well, two reasons. One, people buy from people. Okay, second of all, that writing on your logo is so tiny on mobile. And about 90% of your people are coming from mobile. So you want to take your profile picture. If you're a solo entrepreneur, make sure it's you. Okay. If it's you and like your spouse that own the business, get a photo of you guys. Okay. If it's you and your staff, 
get a photo of you and your staff, okay? So definitely some things to change. So I'm gonna know in the comments, what do you need to change on your Facebook page, okay? If you're in my private mentorship, um, this is part of what we go over is I give you suggestions, I give you the templates um, and help you just design that so that it is showcasing who your business is, okay? So anyway, I would love to see your business cover and profile. So once you fix it, put a link in the, in the comments and I'll go take a look at it, okay? And give you a little bit of feedback. Y'all have a great day.